Red Dead Online needs a new role. For example, the taxidermy role has been spoken about and apparently is in the game files for Red Dead Online and we're still yet to see it. Now, the comparison between getting updates with roles to getting updates with not having a role is, is completely crazy. Because when we get updates with, that's not a role, example, Blood Money update, so many players are upset. And, you know, Rockstar, when it comes to these recent updates we've had for Red Dead Online, it kind of makes us give, you know, we have this image of Rockstar looking like this old guy, you know, broke. They act like they're broke, but they're not. And, you know, what I'm trying to say is, guys, when there's a role coming to Red Dead Online, it works. Players are happy. When you have a role, it means you have stuff to do for a longer period of time. But when we have updates like a couple of call to arms maps or an update like Blood Money, it's content that's only going to last two, three days. And Red Dead Online has been dry for so long. And this excludes the new players. I mean, we have loads of new players to Red Dead Online every day. And this doesn't this video doesn't really count for them because they have a lot of content to get through right now. So this video wouldn't make sense to them. But us veterans that have been here since day one, um, obviously the last year, well, longer than the last year, but we'll just go by the last year, but it's been really dry in Red Dead Online. And we've had some kind of updates. Yeah, they're small, minimum. We know the reason behind it, why it's small, because they've been working on the GTA trilogy. We get that. But I think when Rockstar want to come back into you know, full production for Red Dead Online and get it going again. They need to start off with a role. We need a new role. For me, from playing since day one, for me, roles have always been the best updates for Red Dead Online. They definitely need to bring the roles back. 100%. Now, getting a new role compared to getting a role expansion is completely different. And this is what I was thinking about uh, to myself just yesterday. And... Yeah, I mean, I a lot of people don't agree, but I do agree with role expansions. I think, you know, improving and expanding current roles that we have in Red Dead Online makes sense to me. I think it's just the way Rockstar do it. You know, when we got the uh, Bounty Hunter expansion, it was small. It was dry. You know, without even trying, you could finish it in just... 48 hours and for me that's not enough content so i mean up next apparently is the trader role expansion apparently that could be coming this december um again i hope they don't go down the same road as the bounty hunter expansion you know it was so small i mean i would love a trader expansion come december but if it's as small as bounty hunter expansion and as dry as that then they might as well as keep it i mean if you're going to expand a role, at least give us <laughs> at least one week minimum of content for that expanded role. Minimum one week, at least. We don't even get that. We get two days content, maybe three days tops over the last year anyway. Um, I mean, Bounty Hunter role, I will say that's a good one because you can forever do it. But again, you're doing the same thing over and over. Uh, but yeah, I will say Bounty Hunter is good. The expansion itself, though, again, going back today, was small. It weren't big enough. You know, it, it didn't really feel like an expansion. It just, I don't know. It was just 10 added ranks, a couple of items to unlock. That was it. And yeah, I mean, they could do better than that. And I'm hoping they do better than that for the Trader Roll expansion. And then later, we should be getting the uh, collector role expansion i know we're definitely getting the naturalist role expansion because we will be seeing legendary fish added to red dead online they've been in the game files for for quite some time now um a lot of you people could probably find this information out as well if you follow mcdizzle gaming he's a a really um liable source when it comes to red dead online he, he finds out a lot of stuff um yeah, and he's a great guy. So McDizzle Gaming, check him out. Um, yeah, and, and you know, Red Dead Online needs a role now, I think. Um, yeah, okay, December we could get a trader role expansion. It's not a new role, but for me, I, I'm i hoping for that in a way because 
we know it's slow times for Red Dead Online, so we we know we can't expect too much. But a Trader of Wild expansion, I'm expecting that for December. Um, have I got high hopes for it? No, because I don't think it's going to be big. It's just going to be like the Bounty Hunter expansion. Um, small, dry, finished in 24 to 48 hours, maybe 72 hours, depending on how slow you go. Um, but yeah, I mean like that that is it really like we need a new role we do because whenever we've had an update like a recent one um well we got the quick draw passes didn't we and and that that was boring i mean it was just one outlaw pass split into four categories that's all it was it was just lazy work and we can see how lazy it is um Blood Money itself, the missions were just copy and paste. You know, you go to a place, you loot something, you you deliver it over and over, over and over. All the missions just had different names, titles. <laughs> and um, what really got me as well is, um, what's his name? Martelli? Martelli, the main guy. He's not actually in the game. You see him in a cutscene and that is it. He's not actually in the game. You don't see him, you don't, you're not moving with your character and you see him, you just see him in a cutscene. It's lazy work and it didn't work. I mean, they could have done so much more and so much better when it comes to something like blood money content. It was just lazy work and we need a roll. <laughs> I mean, every time we've had a roll, it works. It keeps us busy. There's content. Bounty Hunter, there's endless content there. Moonshiners, you know, you with the Moonshiner wall and Trader wall, you got something to, you got to put the work in to get the the money out. You know, that was a good business. Um, yeah, I mean, collector wall, that can be boring because you're going around collecting, but it, it's so much content. You think about it, and one of the biggest ones for me, Naturalist wall, did sort of not get, didn't do well in the community, but for me personally, I think it was actually one of the best roles be, purely because. It, it basically had so much content. Think about it. Naturalist role lasted me nearly six months because of I, I wanted to get every single legendary animal in the game. I wanted to rank up the role, which I did pretty fast, actually. There was a lot of content with the Naturalist role. Looking at the content we get today, going back now to the Naturalist role, the Naturalist update was actually a good update, in my opinion, content-wise, anyway. Um, but yeah, 100%, guys, let me know your thoughts down below. We need a new role. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Mm -hmm.